y'all. So I am going to be putting my Christmas planner together. I've never been a person where I do like memory keeping or anything like that. But since I got Kel the fan, which is Kel, Heather Kel's box, I well, first, before I knew I was getting this box, which was given to me as an early Christmas gift, I knew I was going to want to create like something Christmas related just for memory keeping, like what we do each day for December and especially on Christmas break. You know, there's traditions of going to look at the lights and then decorating the tree and all that stuff. So I knew I wanted to do something that was memory keeping. But when I got this, I was like, yes, yes. So I'm going to show you guys what I'm doing. I do have this out here because it has red disc and this is perfect for Christmas. So I'm going to switch the disc out um, for the ones that Heather put in here and just at, just replace them on here. So let's get started. Um, a lot of stuff is already here, like the washi and everything. Um, so yeah, if you are not pledged to my Patreon, which you should be, I don't know what you're doing for $3, you're going to see me create a Christmas bucket list with, um, let me see with these stickers and I'll be creating one and using sticker like these stickers and whatnot. So yes. So I'm taking this out right here and they are the same size, which is nice, which means I'll have to worry about having less paper. So what I'm going to do is um i'm just going to i was like why is there december <laughs> all right so anyway um this is what the paper looks like in here and i have a december dated planner already and so i included that in here because i want to you know do the memory keeping and this is what it looks like very seasonal um and i just have the whole month of december in here just like that so what i what i'm gonna do where is it I know I have it. Um, I know I have like some tape runner, but I don't know where it is. I don't know where it is. Um, but I'm going to end up gluing this to this so it sticks. But I don't have my runner tape with me, which is strange because usually it's right here. Actually, I don't have runner tape, but I do have... Um, this tape right here. Let's see how great it works. But I don't, I don't know where it goes, but I'm not gonna submit, I'm not gonna waste time trying to look for it. Um, let's see, this is from UB, this little, um, all right. I wonder how well this is gonna work. All right. Probably not going to stick very well, which I shouldn't probably shouldn't even worry about it. <laughs> oh my God, I already know. Okay, so what I want to do is kind of just just roll this up like you would any other tape. I'm just going to, I just want to hold it. I'm not going to waste time doing a bunch of tape. Just hold it right there. Okay, so I'm just going to take this and I'm also going to glue that. Just like that. All right, I'm going to take these out. Be nice if I can grab all of it, huh? Oops. All right, just trying to make sure all of these are straightened. All right. Then just put that over there, and then you just want to take out a little bit at a time, like this. And the great thing about these is that you don't have to worry about them being in order because it's not a planner. And as long as they're all facing the same way, you're good. Like, yeah, when you're taking out papers from Happy Planner Disc or Disc in general, take a little bit at a time so you don't mess up your paper. I know we get, like, in a hurry and we're just like, let's hurry up and do it. But don't, <laughs> you don't want to mess up your paper. And it doesn't really take that long in hindsight to do it. 
especially when you get a groove going. All right. just about done and I just love 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 this paper and the great thing about this is that you know I'm, there's no way I'm going to use all Heather said there's 60 pages in here there's no way I'm going to use all 60 pages so I have some for next year as well all right so I'm just going to take this off just like that and I the discs are just plain black Can I just say I love that she, I mean, I'm not even shocked that she did a dismount, but can I just say how much I love that this is a dismount, that I don't have to worry about another system. All right. So next up, what I'm going to do is I need to take all of these off of this disc right here. And there's a lot of filler paper in here. So I'm just going to first take this off and then, all right. And these are the happy notes happy list that came that are part of Stephanie's favorites just the half sheets and I love them one I love the color scheme of it and filler paper is great to just jot things down like if I need some paper I need to stick into my planner I just grab one or a full you know a full sheet of filler paper but I really love the half sheets because it doesn't take up the full page in your planner and then you can just move it from week to week if you need to so this one is a habit tracker that I got on Mercari, which is great. I'm currently not using one right now. Um, just because I don't even know why. I just know I'm not using one. <laughs> so I have more, ha more than three habits I need to track. That's, so that's the main reason. But um, just taking all of these off. So yeah, I got on Mercari is a great way to buy um, happy planner stuff for really, really cheap. And then like to buy things that they don't even sell anymore you can buy and so i really like these it looks like the um you know the things you get from the paint swatches that's what it looks like all right so i'm just going to take these rings or discs rather off of here all right and i'm just going to I'm not going to put this back together on camera. I can do it off. It's not a big deal. All right. Set that over there. And you guys don't even understand how much filler paper I have. Like, you guys know I bought a lot of the companions. So that is filler paper as well. And like I said, I, I have always believed this. Even after using Happy Planner, going back to it, even using Erin Condren, you can never have too much paper, especially blank paper. All right. So I'm just going to move that over there. Put that back over there. And we're going to move these discs out of the way. And now we're going to do the best way to do this when you're putting together a happy planner um, is to put the covers on first. And so you're just going to go like this. I really wish happy planner made some red metal discs because that would be everything. Um, I, I would just love them. So yeah, we're going to put that on right there. And then we're going to do this. Let's put the other cover on. Oops. Oh, this disc wants to come back and be part of the family. It's okay. You'll be back after Christmas. <laughs> well, no, I'll probably just keep these on here because I'm using this for memory keeping. But I'm just going to put them on. Like, why am I having such a hard time with this? Let's scoot up. It's okay. Let me slow down a bit. Maybe I'm moving a little too fast. Let me slow down a bit and, you know, get this going. Like, I... I have a little anxiety right now. I don't know why. So when I have anxiety, um, my ha my hands tend to shake a little more than usual. And so doing things like that's tedious like this is a little bit of a struggle. Just letting you guys know. Anybody who deals with anxiety knows exactly what I'm talking about. So I'm just going to put this back on the disc. And like even though it's not the exact red, look at these red discs against those flowers. It is gorgeous and like I said you know just take your time and do it but yeah that looks really really nice just... all right okay I like I can't even get over this box it's amazing I just love it it's just really really nice um, I, this red, 
And so I'm so glad um, that Heather made this box because it's really, really nice. Everything is going to get used. I mean, everything because there's so many stickers in here. Like there's a lot. Not only am I going to be decorating this, I also have my regular planner that I'll be using to decorate for, I think I'm going to do a, um, a winter spread, Christmas winter spread for every single week in December. And then, well, mostly Christmas because January I can do winter spreads. And I have some winter stickers from Charlotte Paper Co. that I cannot wait to do plan with me's with. Um, but I may do one of them in her planner so you can see how it looks in her planner. Yes, I have her planner. Yeah, how many times do I say planner? Um, so, yeah, I'm excited to, for these plan with me's to come in December because they're exciting. And Christmas is one of my favorite holidays next to Halloween. Um, so, yeah. All right. Just putting this filler paper back in. All right. And so what was I going to say? I don't remember. Um, Cause I'm recording this earlier than I normally record because I wanted to get into this and play with this. So you guys are probably seeing this like, uh, like a month after <laughs> I recorded it, but I wanted to play with everything. So I was like, let me just film a video and I'll just upload it. So yeah, the date I'm doing this is October 20th. And you guys are probably going to see this like around the same time in November. So yeah, just letting you know, I'm not the only person that does this. There's a lot of YouTubers who do things months in advance because they just want to get it out of the way and I don't mind it, especially if I'm feeling really inspired. I just, you know, get it out of the way. All right. And you guys like Happy Planner also has a holiday box. And I've been like, should I get it? Should I not get it? I don't know. But, you know, I, who knows? I'll probably have, by the time you see this video, I'll either have it or not. If I don't have it by the time I film this video, I'm not getting it. Um, so there's that. <laughs> All right, so. Okay. I love, oh my God. It just, it looks so good next to this, you know, those lighter colors. And so um, this planner spread right here, um, a sweet girl named Yvonne who lives in my city gave me a bunch of planner stuff and she gave me a dated planner and I looked at it, I was like, oh, this would be great to use for Christmas. So that is what I'm using. And I'm not, I'm not throwing anything out yet. I'm not because the pages in there, I can always redate it and use the spread if I want to. So we have that set up right there. Oops. All right. Oh my gosh, she's so gorgeous. I love, 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 love this. Okay, so let's see if there's anything I actually wanna put on these pages. Um, while I'm sitting here putting this together. All right, so we have. So how many weeks? We have one, two, three, four, five so we have five weeks there's a ton of stickers in here all right so so she has how many how many weekly sheets in here one two three she has five wow that is enough for me to do every week in december it is it's enough for me to do every single week okay so let's go back to the beginning because I can easily just do this now while I'm sitting here. Okay. Because this is memory keeping. So I won't be doing like any plan with these in here. This is just like for what we did that day. Like some journaling, memory keeping. So let's see which one I want to put. Um, you know. Okay. I guess it doesn't matter because... It doesn't really matter because they're all Christmassy. So we have a plaid. I don't want to do a plaid next to a plaid. Okay, so we'll do. I think for, for Christmas Day, for the Christmas week, I kind of want to, that one. And that is... The 25th is December, so I want to use that one right there. And then 
because this planner ends on the third. So I will save like a New Year's, maybe, no, you know, it's okay. All right, so we have that right there. And then, huh. I'm gonna put that right there. And then, let's see, I'll put that run right there. And then that one. Am I missing? I'm missing a week. So I counted five. Okay. There we go. That is the one. Is there one that doesn't say Christmas? Because it's after Christmas. If, there, if there's one that doesn't say Christmas. Um, okay, I want to save that one for Christmas Day. The week of Christmas. Okay. Meet me under the mistletoe. That one can be for you know for Christmas Eve because you know the New Year's kiss and all of that stuff. And then that one can go right there. All right, we got the stickers ready for each week. Okay, and so is there anything, anything I'm going to be using, so I can also use these. This is going to be a special Patreon, and Heather said the, this sticker lines up for two, a double box. So yeah, this is going to be a Patreon video. Um, these may go on the plan with me's and whatnot, maybe. Um, so yeah, I, lo I love, love, love this. Okay, so yeah, that is pretty much me setting this up. Um, so w exactly what I'm going to do oops, with this paper is like one of them is going to be like the Christmas bucket list. One of them is going to be like the Christmas bucket list. And that'll probably just go right there. And then one's probably going to be like for gifts, like, you know, Christmas gifts, because I do have, there's a, I have a winter sticker book. Um, like I'll probably like glue this down. Like what is going on? Okay. Like glue some of these down on here. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I cannot wait. So yeah, I don't want to spend time like decorating every single week on here because it'll be here. For, we'll be here forever. But you guys will see it every week. So yeah, I am loving how this is going to turn out. I cannot wait. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me setting up my Christmas planner slash memory keeping. Um, can't wait to get in here. Cannot wait. So yeah, there we go. And let's, first of all, let's take, close this and take a look at these beautiful red discs on here. I just love it. So yeah, I'm gonna get out of here. Any questions or comments, leave them down below. If you are not subscribed, go ahead and do that. I don't know why you're not. I don't know why you're not subscribed but hit the notification bell so you know if I, every single time I upload a video. And if you want to find me on other places, look in my description box. And I am affiliates for some places, not for Heather Keller or anything like that, but I am an affiliate for Happy Planner. So yeah, it helps me, doesn't charge you anything extra. And with that little bit of money, it helps me continue to bring you content, which is always great. So thank you for the support if you use my links for anything. And I'm going to get out of here and I will see you all next time. Bye.